How's it going guys, Zabby here, and today we're going to be going to Falcon Lake to catch the Rainbow Outlaw. Now what you're going to need to do for this one is catch three brown trout, so that way you can get their eggs and catch the Rainbow Outlaw. Now this is a big fish too guys, a lot of these monsters, um, they're pretty good size now, they're getting bigger and bigger uh, the further we go into the game. So let me go to Falcon here, you can see 19 kilograms, pretty solid uh, Rainbow Fish there guys. So that's what it's maxing out at. Very, very solid. So all I'm going to do, guys, is I got three bottom rods set up here. You can use float rods, whatever you guys got. Make sure it's heavy duty, though. All right, because it's going to be a big fish. It's going to be tough to catch. Uh, you can also want to bring around, uh, bring a, a lure setup of some sort just so you can catch the brown trout. I'm also going to use some artificial salmon eggs just to catch the uh, brown trout as well, just to speed things up. So it's really up to you guys what you have for your setup. The other thing you're going to want to do is grab some 2-0 hooks here. I'm just going to go throw them into my backpack. Uh, unfortunately, I'm full, so let's go ahead and do that. Now, if you guys saw my falcon video, which came out earlier this week, it's going to show you guys where to catch brown trout, where to catch rainbow, all that stuff. Um, I'm going to show you guys where to catch the outlaw. It's uh, pretty similar spots to where the, uh, the actual fish are as well, so it's not too confusing. And I also, I, I brought a, a float rod just because... If you guys have uh, fluorocarbon leaders you can use, give those a shot as well. But other than that, you don't really need too much. Just make sure you got some artificial salmon eggs to catch the brown trout. And then once we get the, uh, the brown trout eggs, we can be good to go catch the rainbow outlaw. So once you have all that done, head over to Falcon, grab an advanced license. And we are going to go to Falcon right now, guys. I will see you there. All right, guys, when you get here, come into the boat spawn and come to the left here to catch the brown trout now this is where the rainbow outlaw is going to be as well if you guys do have a boat you definitely can go in the boat to try and catch the outlaw uh, the only reason i'm not is because it's going to speed it up a little bit if i have multiple rods out there at one time but if you guys have a boat and you don't necessarily have a setup big enough to go there maybe even rent a boat uh just cast in this general area here and you'll be good to go so you see here i'm using two o uh regular hooks i'm using a bottom rod artificial salmon eggs i'm just gonna go ahead uh, double check the peak here so we're all right might even go an hour ahead let's go an hour ahead just so we're right in the peak i'm just gonna cast out here guys and again in my falcon video i showed you guys where to catch brown trout you can catch them all over the place here so don't worry too much about it i'm just gonna go ahead throw all these down here try and catch some brown trout and when I get some on, I will show you guys, and then we will get the brown trout eggs ready for the rainbow outlaw. All right, guys, so there is one brown trout. Hopefully, we got another one on here, but you can see you get them pretty quickly. It's not going to take you too long to grab these brown trout. Uh, there's a second one right there. So we just need one more before we go ahead and get the bait. All right, guys, there we go. We caught our third brown trout here. We're going to go ahead and keep that, and now we are going to get the bait for the rainbow outlaw see we got some brown trout eggs here all right guys once you have the brown trout eggs go ahead and put on a bunch of 4-0 hooks you can also do 5-0 i'm gonna do 5-0 on my two uh heavier duty rods just because why not and then all you're gonna do is go to the night time so let's take a quick peek here we'll go to about uh you can go to about two or three in the morning you can see here the peak starts really shooting up so let's just go tell Let's go tell two, three. I, I, we'll just go to three. We'll go to three. Go to three. So at night peak. Now I'm just going to go ahead and cast basically all in a line just along this uh, deep area here all the way through here. So just go ahead, guys. Throw all your rods out there. Remember, if you have a boat, same type of thing. Just come to this area in your boat. Uh, leave the anchor up so it's easy to bring them in if you have under level gear for this fish. That's all you got to do, guys, is basically just cast out here, throw your your lines wherever you want. Uh, there's no specific spot, but anywhere along here will do fine. I'm going to throw this one way back there, just in case. And then I'm going to throw the float rod just up here, a little bit more to the left, actually. Uh, let's go... We're going to go inside a little bit more. We're going to go, like, right, right here with the float rod. Now it is, I think it's at like 180 centimeters depth, so if I do catch them on that, um, I will show you guys the conversion, but I have a feeling I'm going to get them on the bottom rods. But all you got to do guys now is sit here and wait, and eventually he will bite. Alright guys, it looks like we have the Rainbow Outlaw, and we actually did get him on the float rod, it seems. So I will give you guys the depth uh, and the conversion for the depth for Imperial, but I believe it was 180 centimeters. I will throw it up on the screen. 
But you can see here, this is a very, very big fish. And this is uh, the Majesty rod. So this is a pretty good rod, pretty good reel, pretty good uh, weight for line. And he's still fighting, guys. So if you have a boat, use it. If not, then maybe do it from the shore. Uh, but definitely use a boat if you got a lighter setup. All right, guys, and just let him pull you around the uh, lake, kind of like you do with the musky golem. This is going to be a decent sized fish, boys. And that's uh, pretty much all you got to do is just, if you don't catch them the first night, go to the next day and go to the next night and just go to like the start of the peak or whatever. I'll show you guys which, which day type I caught them on. But there we go. The Rainbow Outlaw. You love to see it. Uh, 4,800 bucks, 4,000 XP. We'll take a quick little picture with them. And there you go, guys. There is the Rainbow Outlaw. Big fish. Big, big fish. Let me place a marker down for you guys. And I will show you the, uh, the depth I was using. So there's the marker. Again, this was about 2 o'clock in the morning. Um, on this night here, so if you want to try and match that exactly uh, Go ahead. I didn't have any luck the first night So just uh, do a cloudy night like that go to two o'clock and give that a shot and it's just out there guys uh, Let me throw up the conversion here for how far So you guys kind of have an idea of exactly where I caught him So that's about 43 meters out From this location right here and let me reel in here and I'll grab the uh, leader length And the leader length was 180 centimeters. I'll throw the conversion up for you guys. But that is how you catch the Rainbow Outlaw. I will catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching, everyone. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you liked the video, make sure to hit that like button and that subscribe button. Ring the bell so you don't miss a single video. Check out the description for links to my other social media platforms like Twitch, where I stream five days a week. Come hang out live. It's a lot of fun. Also, make sure to come type a comment. Tell me to catch more fish or whatever you guys want. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.